G'day guys, what's cracking? Two Aussie here again. So today we're hitting Lawson again in the Blue Mountains. I'm going into a place called Chicken Coop. It's a Portuguese style chicken joint. Something I've been wanting to get around to for a while, but to tell you the truth, I actually forgot about them. All jokes aside, these guys do seem to be struggling at the moment, so it's probably a good thing. Not that I'm going to save their business, but it's probably a good thing I remembered um, to check them out. So today I'm going to grab their Peri Peri Cooper Burger with a combo with some chips and a can of drink. 16 bucks. So guys, we're heading in there. Support one of these local businesses who actually are struggling. But what I like about this joint is what I've seen so far is they have a menu and you can look through the menu there on their Google page, which is good. I only have a 3.9 Google star Google rating, but I don't think they've been there for too many years either. Probably only a couple. So reasonably new establishment, not a good time to be opening it. Well, I guess they didn't know, but not a good time to be opening a business at the moment, especially in a place like this, it's touristy. So guys, we're gonna go and support these, but there's a little something that I thought about that we could do in the future to try and maybe help some of these guys out after everything gets back to whatever normal we're going to have. But we're not going to go on about COVID and all that crap today. I'm totally trying to keep out of that. I'm not one bit interested. There's too much talk. So, but later on, once I get the burger and everything, I'll have a little chat to you about an idea that I had to maybe help out a little bit. So guys, that's the deal today. We're going in to Chicken Coop to get our burger combo. 16 bucks. Let's get it. So let's get jiggy with it. Grab the old trusty steering wheel tree. So we've got our little combo, 16 bucks, as I thought. Now I haven't opened this up. And also, we went with a sun kissed for our Beveragino. 16 bucks for the combo, drink, chips, and the burger. And also we got chicken salt, apparently. <laughs> I wasn't watching. <laughs> There's the burger. Oh, that's a heap of chips. Amazing. I'm loving that. Let's got to have a chip. Although I would call those fries. Chips are on point. Amazing. Let's have some more. Chicken salt. It's the goods. Totally each one. Now, for the burger. So let's have an up close and personal look at our little combo. Alright, let's check out this Peri Peri Coop Burger. Now it should have chicken, Peri Peri, as we can see. Let's give that a little taste. Now it's supposed to be house made Peri Peri, so they make it in house. That <laughs> is actually amazing. It tastes fantastic. Got that little bit of chili taste too. So we got chicken, Peri Peri, what else? What's your grilled chicken? Oh, there's another piece there, so that doesn't, that might look a bit scabby, but there's more there. It's like two pieces. I won't pull that off. Pardon that expression. Not exactly what I meant. Let's have a little bit of peri-peri sauce with the chips. Amazing. That is good. I'd get that as a dipping sauce. Now, tomato, lettuce, and I think there's supposed to be mayo under there too. Let's find out. Looks like it. Not a bad looking little burger. Put that the right way so we have the chicken spread everywhere. And without further ado, it's time to wrap my laughing gear around this one. Let's see what all the hype's about. Because I am getting hyped, I can tell you that. <laughs> getting out of the box is the hard part. Let's break it down here. <clears throat> oh man. All right. Now without further ado, let's tuck in. We are, look at that. 
you'll love to see it top so let's do it pretty decent burger i like it but i reckon if i take another bite there's going to be no lettuce on Oh no, that first bite, everything practically was falling off. We're doing alright so far. I thought, let's just check that mayo, because I couldn't see it from that side. Yep, there's mayo on there. Now I thought, with having mayo and peri-peri sauce, it would be a bit of a super spreader. But I guess that all depends who's putting the sauce on. There's just a, just the right amount of sauce on there. It's amazing. I'm loving it. Let's have some rabbit food. Ooh, didn't notice that did that mayo on it. <laughs> Went everywhere. Anyway, let's give it another red hot crack. This is good. It's like a bib for an adult. You just put that there and everything runs down it and you don't get messy. Wouldn't want to mess up my Stay Fresh shirt, would I? It wouldn't be very fresh now, would it? Let's give it another, give it another crack. Well, I can't lie. This is a pretty decent burger and I'm loving that house made peri peri you can see some of it there that is a winner 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 peri peri coop burger chicken burger sorry try a bit of that chicken on its own so i'm already going to rate this for value i'm going to give it a Four and a quarter stars out of, no, actually, you know what, considering how much chips there are, I'm going to give it four and a half stars out of five for value, 16 bucks. And for taste, you know what, I'm going to rate the burger and chips, we know what Sunkiss tastes like, it's a, we know I wouldn't, I wouldn't get it if I didn't like it. I'm going to give it a, it's lit, I'm giving them five out of five for taste. The burger is phantasmagorical and the chips are totally on point. Three more of that peri peri. It actually does go good with the chips. Let's get in there, get some peri peri. Oh, there's some. I can see it now. Beautiful. I'd get that as a dip. It's good stuff. Now, guys, if you hung in there long enough and listened to me rabbit on, the lady in there, her service was five stars out of five too. Amazing. Now these guys have a three point nine Google star rating. I want to go in there later on. I actually have a bit of trouble doing that, it won't let me do it. But I'm going to go in there and give them a five-star rating. I want you guys, if you can, if you're in the area, go and give them some, some support. But look at their website first and see what days they're open, because I knew this before I went without saying anything. I didn't even ask the lady about that. You'll see it in the footage. They're only open three days a week, and not on the weekend. The weekend is a popular time here when there's tourists. There's no tourists, so I get that. I get why they're doing that. They're only open three weekdays, and on top of that... They're only open from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m., looking at what the times say on those three days. 15 hours a week. That's terrible. But anyway, I have a little plan, and it's not going to come to fruition just yet. But first of all, get in there, try them out if you're in the area. I know there's not going to be that many people that are, and you're limited to what you can do. I'm fortunate I've found a loophole at the moment where I can do a few, bits, few more bits and pieces. But what I want to do is... That's, you know, it may not happen, but we'll see what happens in the future. When things get back to, uh, I'm not going to say normal, I'm going to say the new normal, because things aren't going to be as they were. We all know that. But when they get back to the new normal, or get to the new normal, I'm going to go in there, and I'm going well, to put up a post, and I'm going to do this with a few places, especially ones like this that are struggling and can't keep, having got their doors open as much as they could and probably aren't making a profit. I'm gonna set a date where I say, if you're in the area or if you're not too far away, or you're visiting the area, because people will be visiting the Blue Mountains again once things get get going again, get opened up, we're gonna meet. I'm gonna meet you guys there, and if you can all go there, go to these businesses, we'll have a meet and greet type thing, but 
the main idea of it is not so much to meet me. I know some of you guys do actually want to. I don't get why, <laughs> but that's fun. That's fun. That's good. We I enjoy that when I meet you guys in the street. It's always fun. Just happen to run into people that know who I am. But we're going to go in there and people are going to, even if you come up there and you can't afford it, to buy a, a meal like this, you just buy a drink, buy us chips. The chips are beautiful, so you're not going to miss out on that. You're not going to, you're going to get some good chips if nothing else. But also, even though they didn't have it advertised on the window, they've got the wine and dine things too. That's actually been extended till June next year. And I asked the lady there if I came in and used that because I'd already paid for it. I didn't realize they had it. If I came in and paid and used the wine and dine things or the vouchers on the Service New South Wales app, how hard is it for her to get the money back? She said in the beginning it was a little bit difficult. It wasn't working out the plan. But now the system's fixed and it's, everything's cool. So you can even use your vouchers. If you can't afford it, still come up, use one of your vouchers, use both your vouchers. Everyone's a winner, baby. And we'll all do it. And I'll meet you guys. It'll be a win-win situation. But we have to get to that stage first. So don't get too excited yet and I won't either. But I plan on doing that. I'll put a post on YouTube and all over the place saying where I'll be and when I'll be. And we'll go in and support a, a local business here and there. It won't be like people commenting saying, I oh, suppose support your local, support your local. We actually will be going there and we'll be filming it and we'll be doing it. And you guys will even be in the video if you want. And if you don't want, that's cool too. So guys, I better, I was going to almost swear and say STFU, but I won't say that. Um, but where's my cup? So I'll put it a bit more politely and I'll say... I've greased it up now so you see that it wasn't dirty it's my bloody mayonnaise fingers and I like a dumbass I forgot to grab some serviettes but never fear guys don't worry I have some in the glove box for when I need it let's crack this Bivrogino open and today's drinky poo is brought to you from chicken coop in Lawson on the highway if I didn't mention that it's right on the highway where all the shops are Sunkissed brought to you by chicken coop Portuguese style chicken and when I go again, I'm going to get some chicken. Ghibli. I should have learned how to say it in Portuguese, shouldn't I? So guys, I won't bore you while I eat the rest of this. I'm going to be here for a while eating this lot. <laughs> but it's a good top meal. 16 bucks. I'm pretty impressed. If you do go to Chicken Coop in Lawson, Blue Mountains, if you're a local or you haven't been there before and you're not far like me, give them a crack. Check out their Google site. There's plenty of information on there. They've got the menu, the prices, the hours. It's all happening. So guys, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, you can never be too Aussie. Hooroo. And we may meet sometime. Stay fresh. Fantasmagorical meal. So glad I did it.